realize I've been making all these videos and I've never really kind of explained myself or why I'm doing it, whatever. I, mean, I do this because it makes me happy. I like to do it. I like the editing process. I like the, the filming process. I like to just kind of show what I'm doing because I mean, I tell a lot of stories and I love telling stories and people a lot of the times just kind of don't believe me. They're like, oh, there's no way you did that. Like that, there's no way that could happen. It's like, I mean, I always, I don't like, I don't make up these stories. Like, I do a lot of the stuff I say. Like, if I'm telling you a story, I did it. Like, especially because the details are often like crazy. So I figured might as well just bring the camera along because I don't plan for those stories to happen. They just kind of happen throughout my normal day. Like I'll be going along just doing boring stuff like everyone else and then next thing you know, boom, something crazy happens and no one's gonna believe it. So I, I figured, hey, record it, might as well. Uh, it'll be fun to show. And it also has taught me a lot. It's taught me a lot of like my time management skills, like what's really important, prioritizing things. And it makes me happy. And honestly, as long as it makes you happy, go for it, do what you want. Like that's the whole point of everything, you know? Like if you're not doing something, if you're doing something and it doesn't make you happy, why are you doing it? You know, it's, why waste your time on something that you don't enjoy? So that's a little bit about why I do it. You know, there's, I've, I've kind of limited my three things that really bring me true happiness and it's uh, fitness, family, and friends. Fitness gives me an outlet. It gives me something I can do and take my mind off of everything. Like have some me time where I can work out the stress of the day, get whatever is bothering me off my mind, just take it out on the weights, and always gives me something to improve upon, you know, so I'm always building on my body, I'm always building on, can I do an extra 10 minutes of cardio, can I curl that extra five pounds for one more rep, you know, can, can, I, can I break this barrier? Because if I can break a barrier that I've set for myself, if I say, I, oh, there's no way I can curl that 65 pound dumbbell, if I can go out and do that, like, physically, I never thought I could do that. And that carries over, that carries over to my life, you know, like, oh, I never thought I could write that 60 page paper, but I did. You know, I never thought I could do that amount of research. I never thought I could become an expert in like these, the field of communications, but that's what I'm doing. That's what I am. Like I am, I'm learning every day and you know, we're all learning every day. Maybe it's not something in a textbook. Maybe it's something about ourselves. Maybe it's something about our friends, our family, about the world, about life. And that's what it's all about. So I just figured I'd sneak this little vlog in while I'm driving to the gym to get my cardio done. Um, and then family for me is it's, it's somebody that I always know has my back and I'm always striving to pay them back for what they've done to me. I, I mean, they don't expect anything from me, but I, I want to give back, you know? I, they've done so much for me, they've sacrificed so much for me so I could have the best. And I am so appreciative of that and I just constantly am pushing myself just so I can give back and not even just to them but to everyone you know like my friends I want to give back to my friends I want to give back to my family I want to give back to strangers I'm, I want to give back to you guys I'm giving you guys free tips free information about health fitness lifestyle things that I learned the hard way that I feel that everyone should know because everyone deserves to be successful and it just comes down to the to your willingness to put in the work and to take the advice that you're given and make the best of it and then with my friends, you know, it's like they're always there. They, they allow me to push myself, allow me to try new things because without like a good set of friends, you're, you're not going to go outside your comfort zone too often. You're not, you're not going to be sitting there on the couch one day alone and say, you know what, I'm going to go try this new thing today. I'm going to go try skydiving, you know, like it's. That old term of like, oh, if your friend jumped off a bridge, would you? Like, no, I'm not gonna jump off a bridge to kill myself. Like, that's crazy. But, that's a pretty funny bumper sticker. It says it, with the little guy humping it. Um, but it's like, if my friends jump off a bridge because they're bungee jumping, maybe I'm gonna love bungee jumping. So I'm gonna go do that with them. I'm not a follower, but we're all experimenting with our lives together. And no one is like, maybe, I mean, very few people, I don't want to say no one, but very few people are going to take that initiative on their own and say, I'm going to go bungee jumping today alone. I'm going to go try this crazy new thing that might open up new doors in my life by myself. A lot of that comes with friends. And that's what I love about it. You know, like that's what makes me so happy is always trying new things and going out and exploring the world that we live in and just making the best of my life because I only get one of them. So I might as well try everything I can because who knows what I'm gonna love? Who knows where that's gonna take me? Who knows if, I mean, if I never got into fitness, I would've never gotten into YouTubing. If I never got into that, like, 
I never would have learned a lot of the things that I learned and I I owe it to my friends to my family and to myself to, to, to make the best of my life so there's a little deep vlog for the day uh, I'm almost to the gym I'm already sweating like crazy because it's 85 degrees out and I'm wearing a hoodie so I hope you enjoyed this little rant this little vlog about happiness and I hope that you can find yours and let it take you to great places. And if it does, you know, let me know. I'd love to. I'd love to hear your stories. I'm, I'm, as much as I love telling stories, I love hearing stories of both success, failure, trials, everything. You know, I, I want to hear it all. So, link me, comment to me, email me, whatever. Just share away, and good luck on your own little adventures.